Uh, she's, uh, she wants my self-love. That's what Deanna wants. And um, Sweater wants my strength, my uh, conditioning. Um, and they don't understand um, that they can't take it from me. Or Deanna might, but she does it anyway, or I'm not sure. Um, no, I think they, for, no, if they understood, they wouldn't do it, that's right. Um, uh, because of the trauma Deanna went through, she she's forgotten parts of herself. And I wonder if, um, while watching my videos, when we were slowly um, getting more and more enmeshed in a unnatural uh fight um this is back when i first started my youtube channel or not long after um i think she saw the love i have for myself and she didn't understand it um and you know she's uh, the strongest smartest expression of lily so um to her it must have been a shock because she's she's li she's lily lily's a uh, if anyone's good at and good with understanding or self love, whatever you want to call it, it's Lily. So she, I think she had a lot of pride in that, and seeing um, the understanding I have for myself, I think she was jealous, perhaps. I remember getting a hint of her being jealous or something, but I didn't quite, I couldn't quite figure it out because it didn't, to me, it didn't fit with her character. So. And I'm still a little bit not sure about it. Um, but it fits pretty well with what's been happening because she pretty much spends most of the time uh, holding on to the uh, holding on to that focal point. That part of my light body is possessed by her usually most of the time, um, which is why some of my bigger emotions are suppressed pretty much all the time. Um, and then Sweater has another part, big chunk in the middle of me. Um, she wants my strength. Uh, she wants my power. And she's jealous of that. And she has these other reasons, um, which uh, a lot of it is, um, you know, she doesn't... Uh, again, she doesn't know herself very well. Um, so... Uh, yeah, and she has reasons like, um, you know, uh, I'm apparently a low frequency being, and I don't know if she still thinks that, or I, I don't know, um, and, uh, you know, I'm a threat to everything, I can kind of understand that one, but they don't understand it, uh, uh well, they will have, I think they will have an understanding about it that is valid to some degree, but ultimately behind it is lies the, the, the jealousy or the envy, whatever you want to call it. Um, and still, it's just something about saying these beings are jealous of me, uh, Sweater and Deanna. Um, it seems like it doesn't resonate with who they are, but they're not themselves right now. Still, it seems, I don't know, um, I guess this, um, you know, it's because I'm comparing them to me. But that's because we're, 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 our energies are so similar. So it, it's not, it's a useful comparison. Um, no, there's something off about that. There's other information that I will explain when I realize it. But it is, it resonates Quite strongly, yes. Um, uh, and then, of course, got the others. Um, so this is going to be a similar kind of hatred. Um, I see, yeah. So Jay Arrow was basically like the most powerful being on earth, and um, and now he's he's gone. And I think after he went, they had these egos, and they didn't, they weren't aware of these egos because they blindly followed. They likely blindly followed Jay Arrow to quite a degree in many ways. Um, and of course, um, the, this grew a lot of um, beliefs that 
didn't resonate with their being and these beliefs created the arrogance within them which was aroused by me um, 